travelers, hello from Barcelona. Today there are things you should know before taking public transportation. a very good metro and bus service in Barcelona so before explaining you how to use them properly because they are the two most common ways of getting around in the city why don't you just subscribe to my channel because I share really good tips about Barcelona and you can click here also on the bell if you want to get notified when I upload the new videos cities from Europe you need to validate your tickets when you get in and also when you get out of the metro but here in Barcelona we just do it when we enter and if you want to know what transport car to buy while in Barcelona you can do it in every metro stations in these machines we have here but I have a previous video and a complete guide on travel cars you can click here to see this video in case you buy the tickets while which is what we all locals do I want to show you a secret you can check how many trips are left on the other side of the car the last number on the right be aware that if you want to take the stairways in Barcelona you're gonna have to keep on the right hand side because the left is for people that are on a hurry If you have a disability or if you carry a baby stroller almost all the metro stations in Barcelona have an elevator and very important if you don't push the button inside the metro the door won't open either if you are inside or outside the train and remember you can always buy your travel cars in every metro station in the machines either by cash or by credit card and also in the tabac shops also in the bus you only need to validate your tickets when you get in by putting this car like this with the arrow down and if you see a green light it means everything is okay but if you see a red light it means you are putting the car the other way around or that you have no more journeys left or that you are sharing the car with someone else when you enter the bus there's nothing you have to say to the bus driver or the van hello hola que tal this is what everybody says when you are on the bus you will see on the screen the next stop and you can stop the bus by pressing the red button if you see a red sign it means it will stop in the next stop or that somebody else has already pressed the button every bus has a wheelchair ramp and I'm gonna share with you a little secret you know that if you want to get in into the bus you have to use the first door but check it out whenever you see this green sign it means you can also get through that door as well not only the main one the first one but also the one in the middle and when you see the red sign it means you cannot go through if you need to buy a car on the bus they only sell single rides okay and if you need to stop the bus just do like this subscribe to my channel the tram is like the metro but on the outside and we need to push this button here to open the doors and also to get out as well and then we need to validate your tickets in the inside in these machines like on the bus Also in every tram stop there are these beautiful machines where you can buy your travel cards. Something important to know travelers is the working times. We have the metro working from Monday to Thursday from 5 a.m. in the morning till midnight but on Fridays till 2 a.m. in the morning like the tram. But the metro on Saturdays works all night long. 
The bus schedule is not that simple, but a good thing to know is that we have the neat bus from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. in the morning, so it means we can travel by bus also at night. Applications we use for traveling in Barcelona, well, definitely Google Maps. And then we have next bus, which is just for the bus, but uh, with Google Maps, I'm fine, so I don't think you're really gonna have to use it. But then we have two very important applications, which are Cabify and Free Now. These are for the taxis because we don't have Uber anymore. As long as you are a resident in Barcelona, you can subscribe to the Vicen system, which is more or less 50 euros per year. And we use this card and we also have an application. We can use normal bikes and electric ones as well. And for periods shorter than 30 minutes, the normal bikes are free of charge and the electric ones 0.35 cents. For you travelers, you're gonna have to rent your bikes in a rental shop. Okay, travelers, let me enjoy sunny Barcelona. Hope you have enjoyed all my tips on how to get around in the city. If you wanna know what transport car to buy, I'm gonna leave you a video here so that you can check a complete guide on what transport car to buy. Last chance to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet and see you next week, travelers, with a lot of amazing things about Barcelona.